Right, here's the plan. We go in at Khan here. We shoot through France that way, then down this way, ending up in uh, uh, somewhere around here, Saint Jean Pied de Port, and we pick up this road, which you can't see now, which goes over the Pyrenees, up onto the next map, which brings us in over here, oops, over here, into Pamplona. And then we're not sure where we're going, but we know this area is really good for mountains. I quite like to go to Toledo, which is south of Madrid, but that looks like a hell of a drag. So we'll see. And then afterwards we come all the way back to Bilbao, get on the ferry and go all the way up, around Finisterre and back to Portsmouth. So that's a complete circle. Okay. Right, we're 1,057 metres up the Pyrenees and as you can see it's a little bit misty. So we've decided to stop and wait to see if it Right, here's Nick. Funny hat on. With a funny hat on. And there are our bikes. I'll just show you the road we were on. And I'm going to try and attach the camera later to the bike so you can see. Right, there's, there's the road. Right, hopefully get some footage later.
heading down the road towards this mountain and we don't actually know what it's called yet so we're going to find out. In the south of Pamplona. We'll look it up on the map in a minute. We're having a picnic. Just enjoying a cup of coffee and some pasta salad and chorizo and coffee and oh I said coffee and crisps which cost two pounds a bag. Staggering. There we go, Mr. Stork. You're being very quiet now, you're making a lot of noise just now. Mm hmm. I didn't get the crash line. Oh, here he comes again. What the hell? Chuck the other one out. Naughty. It's a bit nest competition. Yeah. Well, perhaps one of them's just a bit thick and keeps landing on the wrong nest. They're all off now. Here we are in a very quaint Spanish village. It's absolutely deserted because it's the middle of the day. And there's the bikes. And we seem to have taken over the entire pass. We're going to have a little look at this church in a minute and also there's some sort of other churchy type object behind all these houses. Two minutes ago you saw Nick having lunch in some weird sort of square. Well we decided to pack it up and bring it literally around the corner to the church that's here. And there's Nick now because this is really beautiful. If we'd just come another 50 metres, we would have seen this before we unpacked. It's absolutely wonderful. This beautiful little river and a bridge. And then we've got this church that we need to go and have a look at. Just come down that mountain and it was absolutely staggering. Really staggering ride. With these we're really on our shoulders, these snow capped peaks. I can't remember how high it was, but it was about fifteen hundred meters. And it was a tiny little road. Hairpin bends all the way. 
quite wearing, but great fun. And we've got some more to come. Well, I had a little bit of a fall yesterday. Came off a bike in the underground car park, and as you can see, I lost my indicator and my mirror. My poor bike. It's looking all lopsided. And then we had quite a lot of trouble getting it going because the carbs are empty of fuel. We're going off to get some arrow out and some tape today. Really good bodge job on the mirror. Gaffer tape and arrow die. Works every time. Yep. Indicators in the middle of being repaired. Okay, we've bodged up my bike and now we're looking for the beach and we seem to have found like a really deep. A very interesting piece of shore. And as you can see, it's not great weather at the moment. Spanish adventure has been quite something very scary um, mountains were absolutely fantastic have to say car parks are shit which is why I dropped my bike looking forward to our next Spanish adventure <sighs> has to be a longer way around I think right bye for now I need to go to sleep Hi there, it's half past nine. We're halfway between Bilbao and Portsmouth. Um, had a great time in Spain. Really great roads, really nice people. Shit food. Um, they got a bit of an obsession with uh, cured pork, which, um, yeah, I mean, I like sausage, but. They're a bit over the top with it, really. Um, definitely going to do this again and uh, see a bit more of the country. Good fun. Bye bye.